Good morning, Muscoyans! I know that uh, life is in chaos right now and you have, maybe you have so many things in mind and it's a Friday but I want you to bear with me and stay with me for a while because I have something very very important to tell you when I was a seminarian I went for confession and you know after my confession the priest said something that made me cry and you know what? What the priest told me was just one sentence. And that sentence was, God loves you. You see, this is the most important thing that I would ever tell you. Oh dear Bosconian, so precious one, if you are listening to me right now, remember, you are so loved. God loves you so much. God loves you. I know, we've heard this so many times before, parang minsan wala nang effect, and sometimes we don't really think that we are lovable. Parang hindi naman totoo. Or, bakit ako? Siguro you just made some mistakes in your life, or maybe at times, you feel that you're just not enough. Some of us, even can't stand the sight of ourselves and we would say, I hate myself. Baka naka-experience ka na rin na nasaktan ka. Your trust has been broken. I just couldn't believe and accept that somebody would truly love me. Siguro yun yung sinasabi mo sa sarili mo. Feeling mo hindi ka mahal at hindi ka karapat dapat mahalin. But you know what? God loves you, no matter what. The most important person in this world loves you. His eyes gazing upon you with so much love, so much that He will do everything for you. For God so loved the world that He gave His only Son. Beloved Bosconians, do you know what you are? You are the beloved of God. You are special to Him and He loves you. Promise! Huwag ka nang matakot. Huwag ka nang mag-alinlangan. Huwag ka nang magduda. Just allow yourself to be loved. Alam nyo, kapag may experience mo na minahal ka, hindi pwedeng hindi ka rin magmamahal eh. You cannot but answer respond to that love and the way we can best express our love for God is to love our brothers and sisters may isang bosko niyan in a retreat hindi ko makalimutan yung shinir niya sabi niya I promised myself that I would strive to love others the way God loves me so bakit tayo magmamahal? dahil tayo ay minahal tayo ay nilikha sa pagmamahal at tayo ay nilikha para magmahal. In the letter of John, chapter 3, verses 16 to 18, it says, By this we know love, that He laid down His life for us and we ought to lay down our lives for our brothers. And if anyone has the world's riches, and sees his brother in need yet closes his heart against him, how does God's love abide in him? My dear Bosconians, let us not just love in word or talk, but in deed and in truth. Sana, you get my message. You are loved. You are lovable and you are love-able. And my prayer for all of us is this, that all might be loved, that all might rest in the truth that each one of us is a beloved, and in turn be compelled to love, to be loved. Good morning, dear Boscana.